Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome back again to my YouTube channel. There is a video that has caught my attention and I want us to discuss that video alone. While in Pometi, the debut president of this country, Rigathi Kashawa, has given a lecture to Azimio leaders who are joining Kenya Kwanza. It seems like there, is, there are some differences that are going to emerge between Kenya Kwanza leaders and Azimio La Umoja leaders, those who have joined Kenya Kwanza. And I warned this earlier when I saw Raila Moro Dinga allowing his leaders to join William Samuel Ruto's camp and work together. This has come a day after they have finished Nyanza uh, Nyanza tour. So, this video, I'm going to play it, then it's going to open up our discussion in this, uh, in this video. So, this is something that is so tricky when it comes to politics. We're going to see it and how is it going to affect uh, some people politically. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to this YouTube channel. Just in case you are new here and you've not subscribed, kindly I'm requesting that you may take a moment, subscribe and put on the notification bell so that every time I'm doing a new video, YouTube will automatically notify you. And for the returning subscribers, thank you very much for always coming back to support the content of this channel. This fights because of you guys and I don't take it for granted. So guys, I want you to take a moment watch Rigati Kashawa's speech today, then it will open up the discussion of this video. Have a look. Imepangwa na imepangika. Na tumekuwa, tumechukua muda kidogo kwa sababu hatu kuwa na serikali. Lakini sasa serikali imeundwa, rais wa metuita pale, ametupatia mwelekeo na maagizo, na vili anataka hii Kenya ikae, Ndiyo aweze kutimiza ahadi ambazo alitoa kwa niamba yetu kwa watu wa Kenya. Nimesikia hapa waishimua melia mambo ya majani chai na ni kweli. Na rais ameniagiza mwaka huu nikiendelea kumusaidia. Nimulike mambo matatu nikimusaidia. Mambo ya kahawa, majani chai na maziwa. Na wale watu wenye kukula jasho la mkulima wa majani chai siku zenu zimeisha nyinyi tutaonana na nyinyi mumeumiza wakulima siku mingi na your excellency tunaona hawa magazeti ambayo walikuwa naunga azimio mkono wakisema we ufai mimi sifai sasa wanatukemea atituache kuambia wa Kenya ukweli Ati tulikuta Kenya hakuna kitu kwa store. Hata panya walikuwa meondoka hakuna kitu ya kukula. Hawa watu wameumiza wakulima. Tukianza kupamana na hao raizu. Ukisikia wanalia. We angalia pande ile ingine. Wacha mimi ningangana na hii watu. Bile umaniambia kwa niamba hawa na inchi. Tungangana na hawa maduwajari na hawa. He? Eh? Hawa makatel. Na mabruka. Wenye mabengi kubwa kubwa. Na pesa mingi. Yeah. Ingine wameficha ngambo. Yeah. Sasa hii watu wako na pesa mingi. Na hile ya mkulima wanataka. Haiweze yeah. kani. Kwa sababu your excellency. Itakuwaje hao wananchi wamejitokeza. Kukupigia kura. Kwa wingi. Alafu pesa yao iendele kuibiwa we ukiwa raisu wa Kenya. Na sisi tuko hapo watu yako ya mkono. Kwa hivyo. Ningetaka kuambia wakulima mtulie tu kidogo. Mutasikia kifumbi. E, mutasikia. Kwa sababu, munda umepita ya watu wachache watu kumi kuumiza wa Kenya mamilioni. And that is why mulijitokeza kwa wingi, muka kataa ile project, muka sema huyu ile mruto, muna muamini kwa sababu wanaelewa nyinyi. Kwa sababu yeye amekuwa kama nyinyi. Na diyo sisi pale kwetu tulibadilisha jina yake ile kipchichi tukabadilisha na kamau. Kwa sababu anaelewa mambo ya kamau na yule mungine yako pale chini. 
Kwa hivyo tukiendelea mbele kazi imepangwa vizuri. Yes, you have heard it for yourself that is regarding a shower giving a lecture to Azimio leaders who have joined Kenya Kwanza. Regarding a shower is is is, is saying this. He nyumba tulitafuta kura sizi wenyewe and when, when we were campaigning when we were campaigning we had a plan we never did this without a plan so those who are coming from azimiola umoja joining kenya kwanza we don't want you to tell us on how we are going to work we know we are going to work and don't tell us that we are going to fail even if we are going to fail we are going to fail as hustlers in our house na nini so it seems like after kisumu tour there are some leaders from kenya uh, azimila umoja who have sat with the president and they have told the president that this is what we want so mr president try to do, to do some changes so that this country can go ahead and this that you are doing it's going to cost kenyans and that one is not going well to regarding a shower you know very well that regarding a shower also has started uh, preparing for the president for for him to be the president in future after william samuel ruto and that's what regarding a shower started preparing you saw him the other day when he was praying on the mountain he was accompanied by youths and we know that in this country for you to be successive you must have some youths behind you people who are going to support you and people who are going to take you to the ground to make sure that you have succeeded and you have become the president of this country when you are seeing this then it means that regarding a shower is kind of fearing that if the president is going to listen these people from azimura umoja then we are going to fail and this one is going to cost us the way the former president Uhuru Kenyatta did when Uhuru Kenyatta permitted another leaders to join Jubilee Rigathika Shawa and the president that's William Samoy Ruto disagreed and did something we call a mass exodus they 